Alrighty, so Total Rush is the new promo. Um, we have gotten a load of Rush stuff. We'll have a look at the team as well, as we usually tend to do. But of course, first thing up, it's all about the objectives themselves. So we will be definitely getting some modes. Um, this one, uh, Flash Rush Event, Slow It Down, um, will be out tomorrow, I believe. Um, and then the next one's out on the 15th, which I think is maybe on Wednesday, possibly Thursday or Tuesday or Wednesday. Uh, maybe Tuesday, actually. Uh, but obviously you can still play, so you still need the assist goals. You're looking for 15 assisted goals, which is quite difficult. Um, although I think it might be okay, given that everybody's just going to want to score goals. Um Actually, 30 in total, you have to assist over the amount of games that it's going to take to get a total of 140,000 rush points. Now, if you look at it this way, unless they're doing double points for this, a lost game at its lowest is generally around 2,000 points. So it's quite a lot of games. It's at least 70 games to get up here. Um, so it is going to be quite difficult to fit it in over the week. I'm, you know, I don't think I'll get the whole way through all of this, to be honest with you, and get this Ito. But Ito is not a bad looking card. He's not a great looking card either, but he's four star, four star. It's a good start. Right mid, right wing striker. Has the pace, doesn't have the strike, the striking capability, I'm afraid. He does have good defense or attack position and attack position, I should say. Not bad dribbling. Um, probably do with a little bit more of a boost although his agility and balance is quite good definitely is a boost to those reactions his passing is okay it's not great um and he does very bad physical with the exception of stamina so he's not a great card yes of course i would like to have him so we'll still play through the whole week and see if we can get him um but i'm not banking on the fact that we definitely will um let's see world tour uh Danny Parejo has been added in, so we're going to be working on him on a few videos uh, coming up next week. Um, he's very straightforward, um, nothing overly major there, to be honest with you. Really, we're just looking to get as much XP or SP, sorry, I should say, at the minute as we can. Um, there haven't been any, um, I suppose, total rush uh, SBCs. There have been a couple of, oh no, actually there has. Mallory Swanson, I suppose, is counted as one. Now, she has a tremendous card here. Um, no playstyle plus, though, which is very interesting. I would have expected to have gotten that, but she does have a plus plus um, on left mid for a winger. Um, so I think that's quite interesting. She, she should be quite good out on the left-hand side for sure. Um, she's not bad. She doesn't have bad. She's got a five-star weak foot, which is great, of course. Left mid, right wing striker. And left wing the only thing about her is is that she's expensive right so 84 85 86 87 most all with team of the weeks which again is difficult um now they did bring out the team of the week pack again but unfortunately you know yourself it's difficult to get them alex morgan's were brought out as a end of an era card you know, four star five star only plays striker but this card's cracked if you're planning on doing either of the two this is the one although it is more expensive for sure um but she's tremendous she's got that finesse shot plus um and she's got the poacher plus plus which just make her absolutely tremendous in game um no doubt about that the only thing about her of course is that she is expensive 287 and 86 and 84 and 85 um this time though no requirement for team of the weeks which is a plus to be honest with you uh definitely a plus uh we'll go into one of these and we'll have a wee look at the team so we shall let's see we'll, let's go for assuming it's total rush yeah it is okay so as expected we got mbappe though uh, five star, four star on Mbappe. Um, wonderful card. This one's going to be striker, a left wing, of course, playing out of Real Madrid. Champion pace, champion shooting. Um, passing's good. It's good. His vision's good, which is a, a plus, I think. His crossing's not that good for left wing. Um, so something to, to bear in mind. 
Um, very in agility and balance. Um, split, but his reactions at 94, ball control 95, and dribbling 94 with good composure. Like, you know, tremendous good jumping as well, although he will get knocked off the ball. Passing is always the thing for me with Mbappe. Every time I get him every year, his passing always lets him down. So I'd be interested to see what he's like because I have a feeling that yet again his passing will be terrible. But do you know what? It's all good. He has the quick step plus, which means the speed boost is going to be good. And he's a false nine plus and a advanced forward plus plus, uh, making him a genius card. The Brown is up next. The reason why this one is going to be used by every professional the world has ever seen is he now has 80 pace and it's an 80 split as well. Um, he's going to be hard to get, but he is going to be unbelievable. Shooting's very good. Uh, his passing, of course, is excellent as you would expect. Um, agility and balance not so good definitely need to need to be in need of a shunt i'm thinking probably an engine on this card is probably going to be the best um but that will shunt him up lovely he has the incisive pass plus as you would expect ping pass long ball and whipped pass the dead ball and travella um he has that half winger plus so he would fit in my team perfectly <laughs> <laughs> so he would but if we could ever get him uh playmaker plus plus as well he would fit in my team perfectly too but who am i kidding we're not getting him there's no chance james of course the best striker on the game last year i thought i, I i'd still die on that sword today the best striker that existed on fc24 she is five star four star uh right wing right mid and cams so again she'd fit perfectly in my team Great pace, um, excellent shooting, finishing could do with a boost, but in general, very good. Uh, she's definitely more of a winger, I think, on this one, for definite. Um, uh, but again, the pace is so good, to be fair. Vision and crossing, uh, vision's good, crossing's very good, curves okay. I need to see her play styles. Definitely needs a boost to your dribbling, fragility and balance, that's for sure. Uh, although I have a feeling she's going to be cracked either way. Play style she has, long ball and whipped. Trickster plus first touch flare wrap. Aisha has rapid, so she's still going to be quite fast. Um, and then she's coming in with a half winger on cam. Um, wide playmaker plus on right wing and inside forward plus plus on right wing. So definitely um, is the best place to play her, I think, uh, without a shadow of a doubt. Obviously, we got CR7, uh, Swanson we just looked at, um, Dirty Griezmann, of course, we've got in there. The only other one I really want to look at, I'm really interested in, of course, is Trent. Uh, so we'll get a look at him now. False back plus plus and attack and wing back. Um, he has the CDM position as well on this card too, and he's a center half plus. Uh, so, you know, five at the back. <laughs> Good play styles. He has the dead ball, of course, whipped pass, plus long ball pass and incisive. He's got anticipate and he's also got relentless, which you would expect for his card. Still will need a PS boost if we're going to use him at right back. I wouldn't necessarily need it for CDM. Passing, of course, is immaculate, as you would expect. His dribbling's grand, needs a wee bit more work, I think. Again, this is another card that might benefit from an engine. Um, good stamina, though. Um, strike that aggression does need a boost which is why i'm thinking the engine might be good for him does the engine do that or no it's passing and dribbling isn't it or well, maybe look at another um, be a powerhouse or something like that uh, if that's the case if you're playing him as a cdm uh seeing his play styles he is four star four star um i, I obviously would love to get him if i could um let's see if we can find him oh yeah i don't think we can find him so really really excited to see whether we can pack him i doubt we will of course but you know it's worth a try um for sure i'm sure we will get um svava at some point i'm sure we will get uh, terry and jaranovic uh, at some point aspi i would say probably will you know we'll get or at least we'll see uh muriel might be one that comes out i see nick 20 at getting him earlier on 
but there you go. I, I don't think it looks like a bad promo. The issue that I think I'm going to have is how I'm going to fit all of these games in over the next week. But do you know what? We're going to try it. We're going to see how we get on. But so far, so good. <laughs>